Sup guys, so as you guys can see here, I have this seam line here with the knifeless and that's actually following a line that is in the actual cap itself. So there's actually a seam there as well. The only reason why I'm doing that is because this material is a little thicker. So for longevity purposes, we like to do it in two separate pieces. But one thing you gotta remember when you're doing stuff like that is since this has its own texture and its own pattern, you have to make sure it matches up. So this material isn't too difficult. The only thing with it is you gotta make sure that you're keeping it pretty much 100% directional. And the only way you, you'd really notice that is, let's say another installer came and looked at it, he'd be able to see waves within the you know actual carbon itself. But as you guys can see, we kept it pretty much 100% consistent. That's just gonna basically show you, you know, separate the mice from the men, I guess, as far as <laughs> wrap installers. <laughs> This car that we just pulled in here, we're gonna do some quick under eyelids. We gotta take out the bumper, get those things cleaned up and laid. Let's show you guys what they look like. Alright, see these shits right here? I'm gonna ship out these shirts, son. Okay. <laughs> <I can't. laughs> okay. Shout out to whoever gets that 2X right there. Shut up, Oh, oh my god! Oh! <laughs> what was that for? Fuck him up, Fuck him up! Oh! Oh! Almost took you out. Alright, guys, so Mitch's sick. So we're gonna give him some water here. Can you open the cap? Cause I got it. I'm filming. Everything her way. It's the best thing to do is give him some water. Give him a nice little straw. Yo, Mitch. We know you're sick, so we want you to drink some water. Here you go, man. I feel better, brother. No, I'm good. I don't really like water. It's cool. <laughs> that's so that's so disrespectful. What's up, guys? So I'm working on this teal bumper here. Literally just did the last couple trims here on this top piece. We do this for longevity. Make sure that this is gonna stay down. Um, but as far as this bumper, it looks absolutely great. I'm super happy with it. And I just gotta finish up this little cap here and then we're gonna be done. So we got through with the Mint Subaru. It's a 2015 WRX, I believe. Uh, did a full wrap on that. And I mentioned this in the last vlog. How cool it is that I didn't have to touch that and I know that's not a big deal to a lot of people but to me as a shop owner and uh, working with the crew that I have and kind of breeding them kind of with the stuff and educating with wrap stuff that I do and that I know and the way I want things done these guys killed it you know I can't thank my crew enough uh, a lot of you guys know if you're tuned into the channel you guys know that my wife's pregnant and uh, shortly she'll be giving birth and I'm gonna be out of the shop a lot so uh, at least for the first couple months why, why she's getting or why we're getting settled in with a new baby which I'm really excited about uh, but I am nervous you know leaving the shop so uh, really 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 thankful to Mitch and Johnny for stepping up and they're killing it I can't even tell you guys how much I appreciate what they're doing so they went in they wrapped the uh, 2015 WX they did the, from red to mint which is a hard transformation if you guys know about wraps uh, going from certain colors uh, Certain colors are hard. Going from red to mint, that's a hard conversion. You have to take off everything. You have to get the vinyl in every crevice and every nook just to make sure that no red shows. Because the last thing you want to do is wrap this car mint and then in the quarter panels or in the fender lines, see any type of red. You know, so these guys did it. They killed it. And you guys will see that. Uh, I don't know if the cinematics have rolled yet or if we're going to jump into the cinematics of it. Um, but on top of that, 
the media crew here. I mean, I, I guess this video is turning into me saying thank you because I'm just tripping on my whole staff. Everybody's just like was here and they were killing it and I was really happy and it just went up a notch and everybody's killing it. So super thankful for that media team. Wait till you see the cinematics of the uh, Denver X, super dope. And uh, right now, I don't have time to be doing this, but I am. We have Dustin on the way. He's probably just texting me again right now. Um, from what I understand, he's two hours out. That's, that's about the two hour drive from San Diego to here. Uh, we have a couple last minute things we need to finish up on his car. So we're gonna pull out the WRX that we just finished up and pull his car in, finish everything, and hopefully have a happy Dustin Williams. So let's do this. <laughs> So right now, this is behind the scenes of what really goes on when we're in a time crunch. I've been editing all day. John's been editing and filming all day. Uh, we got Daniel right now working on the final touches before Dustin gets here, which will be here in an hour. And if you look outside, uh, I'm not sure if we're, what Cinemax we're going to have for the full Dustin video. But as you can see, we ran out of sunlight. So everything's falling behind. And this is like the major crunch like behind the scenes of what really happens to make sure that the customers are happy. So... This is it. We're going to film it. Thank Let's you. watch everyone be in a bad mood because <laughs> uh, that's what's about to happen right now. How much time we got? Uh, we literally have, we have 45 minutes. We have 45 minutes to get, uh, well, they have 45 minutes to get that on. And then me and John probably are going to have around 15 to 20 minutes to do something that should take about an hour, hour and a half. So as you see, we're negative time right now. So we probably shouldn't be vlogging, <laughs> but we're, we're set. We got the camera equipment ready to go. So I hope you guys enjoy the vlog. Hope you guys have a good Friday. And uh, yeah, let's uh, get to work for Daniel Fires Us. All right, Daniel, what's going on and how long do we have? Uh, at this point, I'm thinking 15 minutes, Dustin will be here. And uh, hopefully he loves it because everybody, the whole crew spent a lot of time getting this thing dialed. And I think it came out really, really cool. Probably gonna take a while before we do another project that takes the cake for style points. I really like this one. All right, guys, so right now we got Daniel doing some final touches. We got John stressing out right now because the car's not ready for uh, cinematics. Bro, oh my god. Oh my god. This is unreal. This is Yeah, This is so cool. Oh my god. 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 Oh and uh, all we give you is his reaction. And the only reason why I did that is out of respect for him. You know, he wants to make sure that he goes the extra mile and gives you guys a full cinematic um, or full cinematic footage of his car wrapped, which it came out sick. It's amazing. I can't wait for you guys to see it. Um, it was exciting for me to see how excited he was and excited how, how excited his friends were to see it. So it was, uh, it was cool. It was a good experience. And my goal with this whole rap for Dustin was not to just give him a rap, but it was to give him an experience, you know. I want him to be able to go tell people about the experience at Premium. And I think we achieved that. And I think you guys will get to see that. Basically choosing a winner. So we're going to go over to the video and pick the winner for last night's I Eat Ass. <laughs> That's so weird to say, but, uh, you know, 800 of you guys said it on the comments too. So uh, we'll go to the comments. And it's for the hoodie. So we're giving away the one of these hoodies to one of you guys. And I can't thank you guys enough for the engagement. You know, having you guys comment by the hundreds, like it's wild to us. You know, we're a smaller channel and we're getting engagement and reach that bigger channels that wish they could have. So super thankful for that. Um, so last night's video was our worst vlog yet, which we named, we thought it was funny. And it was all in regards to Anthony's birthday. So just a cool day at the shop and you guys got to witness that and be a part of that. I'm just going to do a bunch of scrolling and I'm going to go up and I'm going to go down and I'm going to go up and I'm going to go down. So we're going 
pretty far down into the comments uh, now. You know when you pick. Yeah, it's gonna take a while. So I'm gonna keep scrolling because it's gonna be random. I want you guys to know that this is all random, and uh, the person that's gonna win the hoodie, good luck to you. So I'm scrolling all the way to the bottom. This might take a minute, and I'm gonna start going up. Cue Jeopardy <laughs> music. Do do do. All right, so the winner of the hashtag contest is for the hoodie is right here. Oh. Red Ninjas where my finger landed 211 15 hours ago. So he commented last night uh, when the video dropped. I'm going to like that comment. And the right winner. Please email us. So Red Ninja, you're the winner. Congratulations and thank you guys. You guys got to remember we do the hidden hashtag every single day in all of our videos moving forward. So we'll be giving away product every single day, whether it be a hoodie, a t-shirt, a decal. I don't know. Um, so I guess the point of this is to do an outro.